Ten years ago, everybody was designing and developing apps for desktops or laptops. They both have very similar screen sizes, so the work was relatively easy. Fast forward to today, we've got not only handheld phones and tablets, but soon we're going to have glasses and watches, all of which can have apps installed on them. The way developers originally addressed this problem was by building separate apps for every one of the devices that their consumers was using. Now they have the alternative to build a single app that's responsive to the device being used by the consumer. Because of this shift, analysts and designers need the ability to collect and validate requirements for these responsible applications. While well, iRise supports that by allowing studio users to create responsive simulations that are realistic for the stakeholder regardless of what device they're using to review the simulation. The way responsive design works is that you set breakpoints that correspond to the display sizes of different devices, everything from desktops and laptops to mobile phones and tablets. The iRise breakpoint iBlock does exactly the same thing. It allows you to set those breakpoints and then iRise detects the screen size the stakeholder is using and displays the appropriate content. The other characteristic of responsive applications is the fluid changes you see between those breakpoints. The liquid layout eye block from ID8 dynamically displays those changes that happen in those intermediate sizes between the breakpoints. Responsive design also has to adapt to the fact that handheld devices can change orientation. The orientation eye block allows you to execute actions based on orientation changes while a stakeholder is reviewing the simulation. In order for your requirements to be accurate, the simulation needs to mirror the application that you intend to build, regardless of the device the stakeholder is using to review that application. Simulating responsive design is an important part of this ability, and iRise provides the tools to do just that. <laughs>